So we've successfully opened up the app for Story Map Journals, and now you're into the actual creation portion of it. Your first page is entitled your home section, and it's very important at this point that you make sure your home section is set up correctly because this page, it can be edited, but it cannot be moved throughout the story map. And so this is basically the anchor page. And you want to make sure that you have a nice inviting anchor page. I always tell my students to start not with a map that has a bunch of points on it, but maybe with just a simple image. And so you do that by selecting image. And you'll see here, you actually have a bunch of options. You can open with a map. You can open with an image, a video, or even a web page. We're going to open with an image. And you can see you can take hosted images from Flickr. I'm at work right now, this is Facebook, but it's blocked. And so if you're at home and you wanna use a Facebook hosted picture, you can. Picasa, or you can use a picture that's hosted just by a URL. And so we're gonna select URL. And since this, I'm doing this is on national parks, I actually have a picture of the National Park Service logo. And this is from Wiki Commons. And just so I'm, I'm just gonna copy this image address. I'm gonna go back to my story map and I'm just gonna paste that in. And I want to make sure it fits into the page. And I'm going to go ahead and click Next. And this is the side panel. And so you're going to eventually see the National Park logo picture over here. And the side panel is where I get most of my information. This is where I add my text. This is where I can embed videos, embed additional pictures. And so for this first part, I'm just going to type in a tour. Parks. So a tour of several U.S. national parks. And I think at this time it might not be a bad idea to put in a little intro video. The National Park Service has a nice video that they put up on YouTube just kind of explaining the national park system. So I'm going to click on this camera. On the camera I have the option for image or video or web page again. This time we're going to pick video. And it works very well with YouTube, Vimeo. You can use MP4s, but it's just easier to have it hosted on YouTube or Vimeo. And so I'm going to go out and get the URL of the video I wanted. Just right click, copy video URL. Go back to my map journal. I'm just going to paste that in. I have to check and verify it. So when I do that, I'm going to hit select. Just make sure it fits in there. You can mess with the custom settings if you like. The default settings usually work pretty well. Hit apply. And at this point, go ahead and hit add. And you'll see that is what our title page looks like right now. It's, a, it's kind of a basic title page, but it kind of work, walks you through the framework of how to set up this title page. Very important, remember you're not working in a Google Doc platform, and so you wanna make sure that you save frequently. The next video series will show you how to set up a table of contents, and that includes embedding a map over on this main stage.